I've seen it one time. Uh, unfortunately, I didn't get to see it when my team lifted it, but I've uh, seen it when another team lifted it, and it was, it was amazing. Oh, it's so awesome. I mean, it's iconic to be able to see the cup and, you know, just be around it. My son is the captain for the Fresno Monsters and uh, flew in from South Dakota just to watch him play, so I'm very excited to see him play tonight. He's seen it before, and I have not, so he was like, get there early, Mom. Well, I heard stories about uh, the cup, and I heard players uh, they take it to all these different places and I've heard it's been to like maybe at least 20, 25 countries and they do crazy stuff with it, they, they sleep with it, they pour beer in it, they take it to the lake and they just, and uh, we heard it on the paper that it was going to be here and uh, we thought we'd uh, bring our family down and see if we could touch it and take pictures with it. We thought it'd be pretty cool. If you think about it, that goes back way, way many years, I guess, Stanley Lord and they named the cup after him and imagine how many hockey players have actually touched it and carried it and kissed it and who knows what else have they have done with it, you know? So, thought it'd be pretty cool, you know? They're like, you want to stand in line? We're like, yeah, when's the next time we'll get a chance to do this? It's like, what's well, a lifetime thing to do, you know? Because we're never gonna play hockey and you know what I mean? So, it's pretty cool, man.